about to leave El Cuyo and we're gonna drive to Merida but we're going to stop at Tissimine that's a town halfway there to Merida so I'm gonna check it out and see what that's all about so this is it this is the last um, video out of El Cuyo here in Yucatan real pretty very calm um, this is the view from our hotel room look at the color of that water beautiful very relaxed I love it here the town's small I guess there's population is probably a couple of thousand um, there is uh, internet it's spotty uh, there's not a single ATM in the town there's no big stores uh, there's no OXO anything like that no 7-elevens it's a uh, it's a very small uh, I love that as far as that goes but then you know there's those little minor conveniences that um, we try to buy some things at a pharmacy just some toiletries and stuff and uh, the, the credit card wouldn't go through so we had to pay cash and we didn't bring that much cash because we thought we were we would stop at the ATM from Cancun to here um, we didn't stop anywhere and the towns that you go through are very small so anyway so come prepared if you come over here have some cash in hand but other than that it's uh, this is what you get it's it's great Perfect for relaxing. All right. Some omelet, toast, beans, and potatoes. Let's begin. This is what it basically looks like from El Cuyo to Tisamin. It's a whole lot of up and road, not a whole lot to see. However, you will pass a lot of tiny towns, just like this one. But there's not a whole lot to see here, so just uh, fill up the gas tank before headed out. Okay, here we are arriving in Tissimine from the north side. Um, basically takes you through the whole town uh, into the city center. So I'm gonna show you a couple of minutes of this so you can get an idea of what it looks like. Okay, here's a tip for you guys. If you want to save some money and buy snacks, groceries, that sort of thing, just find a Soriana and uh, it's similar to a Walmart and the prices are very good. So here we are stopping. We're gonna get snacks and drinks for the rest of the way in. This is the main plaza. As you can see, those are the uh, city letters. 
and the park is very quiet, very nice, very relaxing. So here in a minute we're going to uh, walk around and we found this uh, guy that was selling uh, raspas, basically snow cones. Más limón, bolsita para que cache todo. Chamoy, sal, ¿sabes? Ya se le perdió la pincel. Anda muy a prisa. A ver, para atrás, está padre aquí. So now it's time for lunch, and we started this uh, taquería called El Toro Loco, the Crazy Bull. Uh, the food was good. I had a torta. My wife had tacos. Um, the place was nice. Uh, you know, the music was a little bit too loud for my liking, but other than that, it was great. This is basically on the outskirts leaving Tisimin. And uh, here at this uh, Pemex, you can get gas if you didn't get any earlier today. At this point, we already enter Merida. These are the outskirts on the east side, you can say. And we just got off the main road uh, that kind of loops around the city. And we basically have to go through a whole lot of neighborhoods to get into the city center. There's no other choice. The drive is beautiful, but it does take quite a bit of a drive.
We have finally arrived. Here it is coming up on the right, Hotel Maria Jose. It's about a um, five minute walk from the main plaza, Emerita. Thanks for watching everyone. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.